It shines weakly. Maybe one only as bright as the Blast Six Star. But at least the poor Lumis will survive now. Meme review. <laughs> Hello, um, we're in this weird state of PB at the moment where like we're all old and our backs hurt and uh, we, ju we just thought, you know what, let's have a midlife crisis now and try and relive our childhood. An influx of just different PB content kind of like happening at once. Got we podcasts have... coming, we've got uh, another smoothie video. It's insane. <laughs> what do you think, man? <laughs> We're going to be playing Super Mario 3D All-Stars. Now, the reason why we're doing this one is because we had a playthrough of Mario Galaxy 2. That we never ended up finishing. Never finished it. It's me, Cordellini. They are obviously not Italian-American. Radiatory! So we just thought, you know, we'll, we'll relive that by going through this a little bit. So we're going to be playing Mario Galaxy 1 today. Yeah. We, I think we both played it as kids, didn't we? Like, we did, yeah. Yeah, it's a good-ass game. Either way, let's get into it. Let's game! <laughs> Are you not aware of you are Mr. Gay? No. Look at the letters that are shining. The only letters that are shining are U, R, M, R, and G, A, Y. <laughs> and in the second game... Only you would notice this. It says, yeah, I am, are you. <laughs> 2007. How old were you in 2007? Uh, to give away your age and precise location. I was, I, I was eight. I was nine, but like I turned 10 that year. It was... That's brilliant. Yeah. Right. Who who do we want as an icon? Uh, let's go Mario. The oh, Toads yeah. brought the shooting stars to the castle where they became the great power star. Mm. Should have been a very happy time for the citizens of the Mushroom Kingdom. It won't like. But then Hitler came. Hitler's page! Oh. <laughs> <laughs> that was the night of the Star Festival, held <laughs> once every hundred years to celebrate the comet. Oh no! <laughs> Poor Toad! <laughs> There's something I'd like to give you from Peach. He looks like a balloon. I thought he looked like a balloon as well. One yeah. of those little like reflective balloons that kids get and they fly away. <laughs> what right? What is with Bowser's size? He's big. He, he's big or he's small. He changes size in every game. Maybe he's like the Hulk. He just gets like bigger the more angry he gets. Red Red Peach. I remember, do you remember in our, our playthrough? I was like, um, my voice for Bowser was this. I think. <laughs> <laughs> Let's the festival's that. over! I love... Behold my massaging machine! <laughs> this yeah. that shot looked amazing in like 2007 and now it, oh, yeah. it still looks kinda good now for what we've got, but like it's you know. Yeah. Like, I, I keep I keep trying to do the spin, but I can't do the bit. spin. And yeah, do you know why the Nintendo Wii is called the Nintendo Wii, by the way, Kai? Here's a little bit of trivia for you. Is this you tricking me or is this actually real? Yeah, this is genuinely real. Okay. Go on. One of the cover names for the GameCube when it was in production was the Wonder Swan, just so like it. The Wonder Swan. Yeah, so it wasn't kind of like given away, it was like a code name. Okay. And so like because, you know, like the Wii can play GameCube games, it's like backwards yes. compatible. I like that. It has W I I Wonder Swan two. That's what it stands oh! for. Oh, who's in this spaceship? Uh, Daleks. Would you care for some? Whenever she yelled like Mario, I was like Peach, have some conviction. Come on. <laughs> you want him to save you, right? Well, it's like the 30 odd time that she's been kidnapped. She's probably used to it. Mario, uh, Mario, come get me. Yeah. He's got me again. You've played. Have you played Super Princess Peach? I think so. Was that the kind of um, was that the kind of Paper Mario style one? Yeah, that's the one where like Mario gets kidnapped instead. Yes, because yes, the role like, reversal. But the thing is, like the the weird thing about it is that's the only time that she's actually gone and rescued Mario. But like. She, she, she clearly has the capability to do that stuff. Yeah. So why does she not rescue herself all the time? And yeah. why is she making us do it? <laughs> oh, this fucking rabbit. Again. Let's Split. play hide and seek. You bastard. The one thing that did always bug me out about Mario Galaxy was the camera. Hmm. Where are yeah, they? Because it's on the Wii. Uh... <laughs> 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 well, right, we, we were in... Where were oh, there we? we where were we the, we were the other night? I'm no, yesterday. Him. We were in like a cafe. I'm getting him. And there was a song that was just like, woohoo! And you're like, times were hard for Mario after Mario Galaxy 2. Yeah. <laughs> One of my favorite videos at the moment <clears throat> is, um, it's like, oh, we're gonna have a problem. You best switch up that attitude. I'm gonna fuck you up. Oh, 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 oh,
Oh, there he is. <laughs> oh, yeah, this thing. Woohoo! <laughs> Wee! I've been watching you from here. This place is called the Gateway to Starry Sky. Peach is a girl, right? Rosalina's a space girl. You can't compete with that. You can't. It's a girl from space. My name's Rosalina. I watch over and protect Cosmos or something. I don't know. Fuck out. She does like. You sound to like say, your dad. To say to a special one, you'll need to travel to, to, to power to travel through space with a boat. <laughs> with a boat. This little fuck stick here will tell you where to go. It's called mm. Bubble Donk de Gonkle Fred. Aye. Robocop 2 can give you this power. <laughs> I entrust you with his care. He seems pretty happy about it. <laughs> you have the ability to spin now. Your dad is best girl. You hear that, Craig? Yes. I am best girl. Press Y. Who do they think we are? Yeah. Children? That's wrong. That's better. I mean, there's no, no difference. Like, <laughs> <laughs> no one else can see, but trust me, it feels different. Can you guarantee for the people at home that it, d- it definitely does? You can feel the difference. I can feel the aura, the presence yeah. of shape. Oh, yeah, of course. Mind. Like, I'm the one actually doing it. I love it. Dude. Go and explore the universe. There's lots and lots of galaxies for you to discover, including my nan's house. It's just wrong. Fuck off. It's wrong. <laughs> yeah, I did. It just doesn't feel right. I'm here. Is that what he says? Yeah. Oh, right. <laughs> it's Mario on a drug trip. I'm here. <laughs> what is up with the weird, like, squashed Goombas? Uh, Are they, like, original design Goombas? I think they're, you know, they're... Well, they're just a different species. Yeah, they're, they're actually called Goonkas. Oh, I saw somebody recently <laughs> saying that the reason why the Grand Inquisitor doesn't look right is because he's a different person. Yeah, he, he's powering. It's true. He, he's like, hello, I lived, bitch. Yeah, these, these ones are actually called Goonkers, Kai. What? They're called Goonkers. Look it on... Why, why does that sound really racist? Look it up on the Mario wiki. I will. <laughs> well, Go- Goomba is like an Italian slur, so... <laughs> called Goonkers. Yeah, Goomba is an Italian slur. I think it just means, like, idiot. <laughs> Type, typing Goomba. Oh, yeah, fine. <laughs> How am I spelling that? G double O. Is it M-K-A or N-K-A? N-K-A. <laughs> oh, it's a sad little... Sad little boy. There's an image of a woman bleeding out of her mouth. What?! <laughs> April Fools. We're recording this in June. No. Get me out of here. One of those enemies should have the key. Fuck them all. The key to my drug box. It's not the Goomba. It's the Goomba. I, I'm aware of the Goomba, Harry. <laughs> I'm aware he's a thing. <laughs> Look at that. Like, why is Mario Galaxy not coming up in the autocomplete? Oh. Maybe it's because Harry's talking bullshit. <laughs> Do you know if you run up really fast then you can kick him? I love doing that. What? Yeah, seriously. Try it with one of the small ones, it won't work with the big one. Yeah. Like, really fast. Like, just just run. Run at him. Why do I feel that you're doing a good thing? I'm not! I'm not! Why can't I do it? <laughs> Why can't I move? <laughs> I didn't do it fast enough. <laughs> you did it faster, Kai. Do you want me to die? <laughs> <laughs> I can tell by that chuckle that you want me to die. Alright. Uh, jump on big boy. How? Jump really high. See? Why are you my downfall today? <laughs> no, you got to spin at him, mate. Because you knock him on his ass, and then you then you jump on him. I kicked his head. All right, no, you're not. That, that was, was easy. easy. You know you can. You, 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 you I know. Like, I'm just doing this to annoy you now. Yeah. That's where, mean, Kai. Where, oh, there we go. A pip. You're being really mean, Kai. I know. It it, it gives me um. Endorphins. I feel victimized. This is a grand star. We have to save it. Weird. So we could do little one. little segments. <laughs> yeah. I think once we've done this little bit, we'll go. Ending the thing. Ha 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 ha. And then we'll start another one. Hello and welcome <laughs> to another episode of Mary. <laughs> Please save the grand star, Mister. He's got my meatloaf recipe inside. This is all the random excess humour today. <laughs> It's got my meat left inside. <laughs> Turn off the flip switches on the floor to shut down the machine. What the fuck do you think I'm doing? What do I do now? Claire is Emily's mother and she makes really good meatloaf. 
What was it you sent to her? Oh, we we sent the quote. It was like Claire, this meatloaf is it's fucking divine. Yeah, because it was. It was genuinely fantastic. Oh yeah, they all need to be yellow. They all need to be yellow. Yeah. I turned them all blue. Yeah. There we go. You're happy. Oh shit. There we go. Don't You're happy now. You. Turn off the foot. Oh they... my god. Yeah, I think they need to be blue. <laughs> they were all blue. All right, now try talking to Loomy McLoom face. Uh, yeah, we need to be yellow. <laughs> uh, I think they're... Oh, they're more of a hit. Oh, there we are. I was a dumb boy. <laughs> there we go. Now they're all green. Which Maybe. is not the colour of blue. Now you need to turn them yellow again. <laughs> Just do that and it shuts the mission down. <laughs> we remain here forever. <laughs> hey! I feel like this is where we should have ended it. You know what? We're still in the first episode. <laughs> are we? What? <laughs> If it, it would feel weird to to not have the ending be the grand star bit. That's it only true. took like a minute to do. I imagine Maria, like stop flirting with the star. I imagine like editing you is just like fuck you, Harry, I'm going further. <laughs> I love this place. One of my favourite things about this game is that like when you finish it you get the black cap. Oh the one where you can just fly you can just around fly. It. Yeah. yeah. Games aren't fun like that anymore. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's the drug house. You've got one crack rock. Hello, lady. How are you? May I eat that little chocolate drop? It shines weakly. Maybe one only as bright as the glass six star. But at least the poor Lumis we survived now. Welcome to Comet Observatory, it's my home. It means so uh, much to me. It's also on to Lumis or some shit, I don't know. You see, we travel starry skies on like 50 boats. <laughs> 50 boats? That's we his fleet! We, pa <laughs> we pass by area every once in 100 years, but we suddenly just stop in front of the planet. Oh, we need to give some context to that, actually. Like, uh, your dad wants to accumulate a fleet. He does, yes. Can you, on your phone, uh, Google how many ships it requires to have To have fleet? a fleet, yeah. Yes. I definitely well, who took our special one picked up the power stars like a fucking bastard. <laughs> <laughs> Look at those eyes. I fully believe that he'll do it. Those eyes have been in a strip club and not paid money. Yeah. This observatory uses uh, star power or something to, to project images of galaxy that scattered across space. A fleet. <laughs> I'm pretty sure and it's like ships. There is a chance that we can use a few, a few remaining stars to look for another power star. <laughs> All right, so he's he's only got boats so far, so like there's a difference between a ship and a boat. Right? What are the classifications? Like you know, like you know how you go like centimeter, meter, right. kilometer. Like, so it, what, it, what would it be? Many navies organize their vessels into task units: three to five ships, task or battle groups, four to ten ships, task forces two to five, task crews and fleets several task forces. Oh, we all get there. Have we talked about his uh his boat names? Like on the air before. I don't think so. <laughs> All right, this is, this is he's you. He's just Craig. googling Robocop two. Yeah. Well, I've, I've got it written down somewhere. Well, he's got one called Bubble De Gonk De Gonkle Bob. Bubble Gonk De Gonkle Bob. Yeah. Uh, he's got uh, a kayak named Maurice. Yeah. Uh, he was going to call it Giggle Mesh of the Destroyer of Worlds. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Uh, I could um save it, absolutely. It, Let's save our game. Yeah, he's got three, hasn't he? He said he's got way more than three. I was on a phone call with him. How? I was on a phone call with him over lockdown, and somebody knocked on the door, and he went, hold on, and it was a boat. What do you mean it was a boat? It's just a boat. How do you fit a boat through a door? With force. How does he afford it? He's a painter. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe he sells them for a lot of money. Maybe it's... Oof! Or maybe he just saves Don't it. Don't incriminate your dad over... <laughs> <laughs> I incriminated my dad over Mario Galaxy. We're, we're no sure, spoilers. We're sure it's not. Oof. We're like ninety-eight percent sure that it's not. Oof. <laughs> that little two percent. Yeah. <laughs>